Right now in Boulder, some of the biggest and brightest art pieces are on display for Boulder Art Week. From performances to exhibits, a lot to enjoy. And Marissa Armas gives us a peek at what you can look forward to seeing. And then anchoring the mural all the way on this end, we have this figure of Gaia. In downtown Boulder, a tour of some of the brightest and biggest art pieces. The first one that you see here is by Greg Deal. That's the symbol for missing and murdered indigenous relatives. A two mile walk with Street Wise Art to not only see the murals on the walls for Boulder Arts Week, but to fill it too. We have a, such a vibrant and diverse community here of art and culture, and all the Streetwise murals are based around artivism, so bridging art and activism, supporting the community, supporting diversity, and uh, really supporting the arts. And a few blocks away, a sidewalk paint party outside of Ema Design Gallery with some of the youngest artists picking up a brush. Every time that this little boy walks by the, uh, you know, the street, he will see his, his little square in front of the store. Year after year, Boulder works to celebrate its arts district, an area that's home to thousands of artists and over 140 arts organizations. But the last two years were challenging. We're trying to really activate um, North Boulder again because this has all been under construction. So now that the construction's gone, we are here to like help decorate the street, help bring the community out, and really know that the artists are here. Artists providing a benefit to the community, proving that art has power beyond the canvas. When we have more art, there's more humanity. We're reminded of our neighbor. We're reminded of beauty, and that affects us on a very deep level. Maris Armas, covering Colorado First.